Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to alter the transitions which is highlighted down here between each of your video segments to show differently. So just as an example I'm going to play this video and watch how in between each tile the transition is different. Now the transition is where the picture changes to the other picture. So that's called the transition. It's not always obvious inside the editor and you can see it between each block. Okay, so to change the transition, what one would do is you want to click on the actual grey transition button. This opens up a selection of different ways that the transition can occur. You can actually have no transition. If you are working on your video and you don't see this grey module here, but you see this small little plus sign at the very bottom just here, that's where you would access the transition. So if I was to click the little plus, it brings up the same menu. Now to change the way that the tiles link together, you can just choose one of them and it will give you an example of what it looks like. So we go along and you can see that the different effects create a different feel to how your video is viewed. Depending on how you set your transitions will depend on the type of immersion you, you could receive from your viewers when they're watching your video. So those are the examples. So we can swap up the transitions. They don't have to be the same throughout the whole project. So we've changed that one. So let's have a look at this one. So it's currently on zoom in. So if we change that to an entrance, it brings a more dynamic entrance to your slide. If we go to this one, we can do fade to white. And then if we did this one, we can perhaps do fade to black. So then to see how all of your sections are joined by your new transitions, you just click the play button. And you can see how the transitions make the video look slightly different. If you choose not to have any transitions at all, what happens is that the, the sections will be matted together and you won't have this transition style between each section. So I'll show you that as an example. So to remove the transitions, you just go to the transition button and you click none. So if we do that for all of these, and you can see what your video looks like without the transitions in place. What happens is that it just flicks over automatically between each slide. You could actually have two or three sections without transitions and the final one or two sections with transitions to make your video a little bit different. So for example, we could have the first three sections without a transition and then add a transition in on the fourth one and then also on the fifth one and then you can again replay your video to see how the changes have affected how your video is viewed by the audience so there's no transition there there isn't one here and then as we go through the video, we change the way the transition works. So now that you've seen how to alter the transitions between each section of your video, why don't you give it a go? 